subject this is because I catch myself thinking about this subject and also making videos about this over and over again because this is my third video in a row talking about this guy. Sorry for the lack of uploads recently though because lately I've just been really, really... I, I just kind of wanted to take a bit of a break because I just... I don't know. I always do stuff outside of YouTube. I'm not, I'm not doing YouTube every day, okay? Except one week maybe in uh, March, I might end up doing a whole a whole week of just uploading every single day. But for right now, that's not the case. So I'm really, really sorry for the people that really like it when I talk about these kind of things. Anyways, to start this video off, recently, YouTuber Logan Paul has gotten his whole channel demonetized. Um, I, I have no words for that. Actually, you know what? I just wanted to talk about most of what people think of this. And I think most people out there are saying that Logan Paul deserves this. He deserves his whole channel to be demonetized. And that's good stuff for YouTubers. Um, not a lot of people are actually saying that, like, Logan Paul doesn't deserve this. Because he really does. And the reason he does is because recently he has tased a dead rat he has also tried to bring his pet goldfish back to life with cpr and he tweeted oh my god you know what i'm just gonna show you guys the clips are we using weapons for this i'm not gonna use my bare hands yeah you're right gonna... here no rat comes into my house without oh getting tased oh my god oh my god die no he's already dead what? Get him! Why? <laughs> no rat comes into my house without getting tased. <laughs> Goodbye, rat. Mm. Okay, no! Taser! No! No! Why? 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 It's already dead. Why? Oh, I hate rats. That is honestly one of the most insensitive moves I've ever seen in my entire life. Showing that Logan doesn't have respect for the death, no matter if it's a human or an animal. He has no respect for the dead. And it's it's disgusting. That that's probably the worst thing he's he's done as of February, as of coming back to YouTube as a whole. Not only does he look so bad right now, but he's he's getting a lot of criticism once again. And I'm not sure if he knows that he deserves it or not, but it's really bad what he did. And I don't think he realizes it. He hasn't said anything about it. It's almost like he just doesn't care, and that's not a good thing at all. You need to care about the dead. You need to actually respect the dead, and that's the point. That That's almost the point of them being dead. I don't know why he would do that at all. Ima just imagine if he tased a dead human. Just imagine that. Well, well no, don't imagine that, because that's really, really bad. But if he actually did that, he would get criticism ten times worse. He would probably be in jail. If he did that, so him doing the dead, him doing the dead rat is almost as bad, because it's still it's still a living thing, and you need to actually respect those. Oh, Brendan! No! <laughs> no. I've just been taking the fattest L's lately. Why? Why? All the other coys are fine. Look at how happy they are. Andy, we have a problem. Andy, Andy. Andy, look, bro. No! no I'm saying. <laughs> We gotta get him, bro. He's still breathing. Dude, that's Goldilocks. He's still breathing. Yo, I feel like putting him on land uh, is not... What do I do? No. CPR? No, dude, I think... No, no, no. We we got got why? Just why? How far can you go just to entertain? This just shows that Logan Paul could seriously care less. Why is he trying to do CPR on a dead fish? This once again proves my point of saying... That Logan has no respect for the dead. And he without a doubt doesn't have any respect for the dead. Especially for animals now. Because he, he just doesn't care. He, he literally doesn't care. And I guess that's just how being a savage and being a maverick is all about. So the last thing that I wanted to talk about is Logan's tweet. Where he said swallowing one Tide Pod per retweet. Why? Personally, I use offensive jokes all the time. Like, like who doesn't these days? But in his way of doing it, 
he's making fun of the fact that people do that and having to go to the hospital. I don't know. It's really, it's really not okay. It's just not okay. But like, I, I know, I know I sound like a hypocrite right now because I make offensive jokes. He made an offensive joke. But let me show you guys this other tweet. Someone has retweeted this tweet saying, clearly someone who has learned from his mistakes and is committed to being a better role model. So it's not really against anybody that makes offensive jokes. It's just against him for saying that he's going to be a better role model for all these other people on YouTube. But except he makes jokes like this to be a better role model. When you make jokes about people dying over Tide Pods, that, that doesn't make you look like a better role model. Actually, that makes you look like a bad role model overall. And it just makes them look so bad. So to conclude this video overall, I'm just going to be honest with you guys. I don't know how much more Logan has to do just for his channel to just get completely terminated from here. But just a message to you, Logan. Just stay away from dead things. You and dead things just don't connect. So please, just stay away from dead things. You just can't stop messing up. Just stay away from dead things, and I think you will be fine, dude. Just please do that. Because it's just not working out for you, dude. So, get 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 together, Logan. Just just get together, man. Like get get your shit straight, man. Just get together. I only called you when it's hell.